what's up everyone, it's Cameron here for another video. So today we got ourselves a Titans trailer breakdown. Now it's not a reaction breakdown because unfortunately I was not patient enough to wait to watch this at home today. So yeah, that's why it's a breakdown because I, I, by the time I saw this news I was currently eating lunch. And I saw this on my notifications, so yeah. That's why um, we have a regular breakdown instead of reaction breakdown. So what's interesting to me is that this looks like Titans is also going on Netflix. It looks like it, so that's going to be interesting. I don't think they have a confirmed date on when it's going to be on Netflix. So what it looks like is that it's probably going to be like an alternative, which I really like how they're doing this for people who can't afford to get a new streaming service, and I hope they do this for some of their other shows. But anyway, um, yeah, I'm I'm still excited um, for this um, season, but it looks like um, we are going to get a um, pretty good se series, in my personal opinion, and um, I'm really looking forward to it. Some people aren't, just because of that first trailer. I feel like since they have a second trailer, they probably knew their mistakes because I feel like their major mistake was, or their main mistake was the editing. Like the editing was not good, especially the music choice. I do not think that music choice was good. However, in the clips for the different characters, that music choice and the way they edited it was much better, in my personal opinion. So, anyway, without wasting any time, let's get right to the breakdown. Oh wait, hang on. Let's uh, turn the volume down so you guys can still hear me. Alright, this looks like, um, I'm pretty sure, uh, the setting is Detroit, so, that's where Nightwing, or Dick Grayson is currently working as a detective, I'm pretty sure. Alright, they mentioned Gotham PD. Alright, there's Dick Grayson in this, uh, just regular detective garb. I'm pretty sure that's not his office, I'm pretty sure that's his apartment, he's getting ready for work, and this is that shot we saw in that first trailer, and in that ramen clipped also all right they say Robin disappeared all right that's uh, that's interesting all right so they also think that he's dead okay so I don't know that's a that's most likely not a reference to Jason Todd because Jason Todd obviously is still alive and is currently Robin so yeah that's interesting <laughs> Alright, the way they edit this, it's a lot better now. Alright, I really like the way he used his, um... I really like the way he used his grappling gun in that shot. Alright, we get an extended shot from that uh, original, um, shot. In that original trailer. Just an extended, uh, version of that, um... An extended version of that, um, interaction. Alright, that's Dove right there. So it looks like um, Dick Grayson and Dove have known each other for a little while. Alright, this is most likely Bruce Wayne right there. Alright, do they reference on ha the falling out between Dick Grayson and Robin? So it looks like what it sounds like from that, um, from that trailer, old friend. So it looks like he's known Beast Boy and Raven for a while. Alright, looks like Raven and Beastway like right away are starting to make that friendship, so I really like that. So it looks like R Starfire has been looking for Raven for a long time. Alright, this looks like some sort of cult that's after Raven for some reason. I really like the uh, ed the way this is edited, and I also really like the uh, font change they decided to go with. Cause that other font I I wasn't the biggest fan of. I I can tell like the Raven effects are a little bit improving. I kind of wish the effects were like red because I grew up watching the uh, Raven um, from um, the Russian Teen Titans, but I'll probably get used to it. We get uh, another shot of Raven using her powers in that shed, just like we saw Beast Boy and Starfire use their powers in that shed in their eclipse. Alright, we see that Starfire absorbs the bullet and turns into energy. Okay, we see a shot of um, 
Dove and Hawk and Dove um, fighting uh, in the streets right here with it looks like Robin. Yeah. Alright, we see Beast Boy transforming. More shots of Robin fighting. So that um that shot right there is pretty interesting to me. So it kinda looks like she might be morphing into that um into her like regular Tamaranian form because maybe she me in this version Starfire is a shapeshifter. That could be potentially interesting. Or maybe she's just examining like her overall strength and it's more than she expected. So maybe she'll gradually get stronger and stronger throughout the season. Yeah, I just really like the music choice. It's a much better than um, um, the previous trait. Alright, it looks like um, Robin and, and Starfire already have that um, relationship that they have from the comics and from the other um, TV shows, too. Alright, there. This um, this logo looks a lot different, because if I can pull it up very quick. Um, give me a second. It's not that logo. I can find the original logo that I saw. Yeah, it's slightly different. I really like the change they went with a more, I don't know, shinier, like, more new and slicker look, whereas this looks like a little bit of ragged and old, like, metallic look. This still has that metallic look, but it's just a lot cleaner. And I really like that. Alright, it's coming soon to Netflix. Most likely, it's probably going to do that thing where they wait like a year for it to go on Netflix. But, uh, yeah. I'm really looking forward to this TV show. And, um, yeah, I, I just think it's a much more improvement over the first trailer, in my personal opinion. The way it was edited, the music choice, all of it. Really, really good. And the effects look like they're really improving. And, um, yeah. So that's going to be it for this little breakdown video. If you could leave a like share this video and subscribe that would be really appreciated turn on notifications so you don't miss any future content leave down leave down in the description i mean not the description comment section uh what you guys think of the new um trailer and i'd like to hear your thoughts and leave feedback down in the description below um i'm all right with constructive criticism as long as you're not a dick about it um yeah and also leave down um what kind of videos you want me to do and also how can i improve on youtube videos They'll be really appreciated because I'm still learning. And also, you guys have any editing tips, really appreciate that as well. But anyway, thanks you guys so much for watching this video, and I will see you next time right here on the channel.